What's up guys, in this short tutorial I will show you how to fix FPS drops while playing Black Ops Cold War. This should be quite an easy tutorial, but if you still have any questions then leave a comment and let me know. Stuttering and frame drops are usually caused by a bottlenecked graphics card. In order to reduce the stress on your GPU, we will first of all take a look at your in-game video settings. Open up the game and navigate to your graphics settings. Here I suggest you to copy most of my settings as these are currently all set to the lowest, apart from some settings which will not change your performance in a major way. Make sure to set your display mode to full screen. I have set it to windowed as it's easier to record. When capping your frame rate, you can save valuable resources and still get a great and stable gaming experience. I suggest setting the gameplay custom frame rate limit to a value above your screen's refresh rate, but below the maximum FPS you can get. Reduce the overall texture and model quality. Under shadows and lighting, I prefer to lower these settings all to the lowest, as shadows should be a priority in gaining performance and reducing FPS drops. In case you are using a low-end graphics card, then make sure that your ray tracing options are all disabled. Under post-processing effects, set the NVIDIA DLSS option to performance, in case you are using an NVIDIA GPU. I prefer to disable motion blur, and lastly, in your advanced settings, make sure not to allow the game to utilize too much VRAM, in case you have other programs running in the background. Don't forget to apply your changes. When this is done, leave the game running and open up your task manager. Here in the processes tab, right click Black Ops Cold War and select to go to details. In the details tab, the Black Ops Cold War application should be highlighted. Simply right click it and set the priority to high. This will in turn allocate more resources to playing the game and should fix stuttering and FPS drops, especially if you have other programs running in the background. In order to reduce the CPU utilization from other programs, I suggest you to end some programs from running in the background which you don't need when playing the game. But make sure to only add the programs from running which you know won't break your operating system. In the Startup tab, you can additionally prevent programs from starting up on System Boot. You can now close the game and exit out of your Task Manager. You should make sure that your graphics driver and operating system is up to date to get the most out of your system. I suggest using the GeForce Experience application if you're using an NVIDIA GPU, but you can also use the AMD driver suit. Depending on how frequently you're updating your GPU, this tweak can make the biggest difference. In the Drivers tab, simply click on Download and the application will automatically download and install the latest driver. Navigate to your GeForce Experience settings. In the General tab, make sure to disable the in-game overlay, which can induce stuttering when running in the background. Next, search for Update to open up your Check for Updates System Settings window. Here, click on Check for Updates, and after downloading the latest OS update, make sure to restart your PC. When this is done, search for Game Bar to open up the Game Bar system settings. Here, uncheck the Recording option, and in the Captures tab, make sure to additionally disable the Background Recording option. These settings will only reduce your performance. If you want to record your gameplay, then I suggest using OBS Studio or an external capture card if you lack performance. Next, search for Graphics Settings and open up your Graphics System Settings. On this window, select Browse and your File Explorer will open up. From here, navigate to the drive on which you saved the game on, Program Files, Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War and in this folder, select the Black Ops Cold War application with the biggest file size and then add it to the program list. Once it's added, you can change the options of the application so that the graphics preference is set to high performance. Lastly, I suggest deleting your temporary files, as these can induce lag if your hard drive is cluttered. Search for percentage, temp, percentage and hit enter. This folder contains all of your temporary files, saved by your programs and should be deleted. You can safely delete everything in this folder. Some files might remain, so just leave them there. I hope this helped you out. Leave a comment if you have any questions and see you in the next one.